how to fix the iPhone not charging problem so let's go through the troubleshoot and see how you can fix this okay the first thing that you need to do is clean the charging port at the bottom here now dust lint and debris often block the lightning or USB-C port right here so you want to keep it nice and clean so what you can do is turn off the iPhone once it is switched off you can use a toothpick or a soft uh, brush uh, not metal and gently remove any lint inside this charging pot right here and then tr try to charge again now do not use needles metal pins or liquid spray inside the pot as it can damage the pins another thing that you can do is try a different charging cable so if one charging cable does not work you may uh, want to try a different uh, charging cable many cases are caused by faulty cables so you may also want to try with another charger as well so if you have a spare charger at home or uh, your friends have a charger you might want to test it with another charger to see if the actual charger is the problem and avoid any cheap unauthorized uh, cables sometimes they can cause a problem with charging the iPhone okay the next thing that you want to do is check around your iPhone for water damage so just give a good inspection so unplug the phone immediately if you detect a uh, liquid uh, if there are liquids around the iPhone uh, let it dry naturally for a few hours uh, do not blow into the pot right here uh, if you uh, can try to use the wireless charging until your charging pot is dry so if you need to use your phone you can use wireless charging here you can is you check the sim tray uh, look inside here to see if it shows any water uh, leaking inside inside your phone you can check on the sim tray to see if there is any water damage so look at the indicator okay so depending on the model of your iPhone sometimes you can ins uh, inspect inside the sim tray for a liquid indicator to see if there is a red marker if there is a red marker that means your phone has been exposed to liquid if there are water at the charging port right here just give it a few hours or a day allowing it to dry naturally from the from the air another thing that you can do is uh, perform a heart reset uh, a heart reset uh, by uh, simply uh, restarting your iPhone so sorry so you want to do a heart restart on the iPhone so what you do is you press on the volume up and then volume down and then press and hold on the side button here press and hold for a few seconds until you see the Apple logo appear on the screen so at this point you want to continue to hold and once you see the Apple logo appear on the screen you can let go of the button so that's how you can force restart uh, quickly press and release on the volume up then volume down and then press and hold on the side button sometimes iOS glitches can stop uh, charging next we want to confirm that your battery is working okay so what you can do is if you have a wireless charging or MagSafe at home uh, try to uh, uh, use it or if your friends have one try to borrow their wireless charger and try to charge it and confirms that your phone is charging okay and not um, the batteries or the cable okay the next uh, one is to um, remove the case so if your phone uh, is uh, covered by a case uh, you want to remove the case or clean heat so overheating stops charging automatically so you want to remove the case let the phone cool down for around 10 to 15 minutes and then try to charge your phone again and see if that works so if you feel your phone is too hot simply allow it to cool down okay next after that what you want to do is to turn off um, optimize battery charging so go into settings then we scroll down and tap on battery and then tap on battery health in here so go into charging uh, it's in the uh, charging section and turn off optimize battery charging so just tap on the turn off button here it said when the charge limit is set to 100 percent allow iphone to wait into to finish charging past 80 percent so if you turn this on 
then your phone may stop charging at 80%. So you want to uh, turn it off so that your phone can charge up to 100%. So this is optional and only affects charging pass uh, 80%. If you still have um, charging problem on your iPhone, then we can try to uh, update iOS. So go back into settings and then we go down and tap on general, then tap on software update. If you find that there are new updates, then go ahead and update your um, iOS now. Sometimes charging bugs need firmware fixes. Okay, so next we can check USB-C port pins or lightning pins. So you want to look inside the port for bent or blocking pins. Uh, if it's damaged, you need the technician to repair it because it is a hardware issue. Now after that, you can also test the phone uh, charging in recovery mode. Uh, what you want to do is put your phone into recovery mode, plug into plug your phone into a Mac or a PC, and if charging works uh, here, then it could be a software issue and not a hardware uh, issue. And lastly, if your phone still uh, not charging, you can visit Apple Store or authorize service and check uh, on the battery. If the battery could be uh, an issue. You may need to uh, service the battery or it could be a charging IC, uh, TriStar, uh, may be bad. So the charging component could be damaged. So you want to uh, check to see if the actual battery is worn out and you may need to replace a new uh, battery. Now there are signs of hardware fault. So you want to seek repair if you see charging only uh, work when the cable is held uh, at an angle or not charging even with wireless plus multiple cables or accessory not supported constantly.